Hi, how's it going on everyone? Welcome to the second video of the React Native AR series. If you missed the first video, be sure to check that one out as I go over everything that will be covered in this series. In today's video, we'll be setting up our project and adding Viral React to our project. So to learn more about Viral React, you can visit viralmedia.com and you can uh, build VR and AR applications using this, uh, what you call framework here. So to get started, uh, we'll just click on this Get Started button to view the documentation. Now, this documentation here is quite old. If you want to view the latest and updated documentation, you can visit the viral community uh, page here on GitHub. So this is where the new uh, documentation is being migrated to from the uh, viral uh, website here, from the viral media. Everything is being migrated to this page here. So to get started here, we'll just use the starter kit that they have here. So it says if you are starting a fresh project with Viral React, consider cloning our starter kit. So let's go ahead and click on the starter kit here. And then we'll go ahead and clone this project. So I've already created a folder here called AR Tutorial, and then I'll just clone this in this uh, folder here so get clone get an LCD into starter kit and then open this in my folder and then also open this in VS code so there's my project and then let's just follow the steps uh, that we need to uh, go through before running the application. So we first need to run npm install. And then after that, uh, we'll run npx pod install, or you could cd into the iOS directory and run pod install from there. Uh, in this case, I'll just copy that command and run npx pod install. So I'll be running this project on an iOS device, and unfortunately, we can't run a augmented reality app on the simulator, so you'll need a physical device to test this application. So once this is done installing, I'll open Xcode and then connect my device to uh, my, my laptop and then run the app from there. So uh, the installation is done. Our pods have been installed. I'll then go ahead and open my iOS application or the iOS workspace file. Then while that is still loading, let me go into my app.js here. So we'll go through this in the next set of uh, next set of videos, just going through uh, Viral React ARC and Viral Text and Viral ARC Navigator. So this will be explained all in the next video. And then we'll also create a basic uh, 3D object uh, like the cube in the previous video. And then we'll go through all of that as well. So let's clean our build folder and then we can build our app and then if the build is successful, okay, so it says build failed here. If the build was successful, then we would have uh, run the app. So what does it say? Uh, it requires a development team. So let's just select the development team. So let's just go to my viral app and then under signing and capabilities, uh, we'll just choose the development team here. So let's try and build again. We'll just clean the build folder and then build once more. And then once the build is successful, we'll then run the application on our device. 
And what this is going to do is that it's just going to display uh, this text uh, that says hello world uh, in our uh, application. So Bill has succeeded. Uh, let's go ahead and run the application. Okay, so the app is running on my device. Uh, it's just building here, as you can see. So as you can see on my uh, phone here, so as you can see there, we have the hello world text. So that's just the basic out of the box uh, setup. Uh, in the next set of videos, we'll just be going over the fundamentals of uh, Viral React and Augmented Reality.